What's up, gamers? Uh, we're gonna go to Popeyes and see if they have the chicken sandwich. We stand united with dogs of America. So we've had them exactly once, and they were so good. We've been back every day, so we're gonna see if they have them today. Okay, I know one more place we can check. I know where they keep the secret spares. No, you're hiding it in here! You wanna just open gold Sark packs again? Yeah. All right. <sighs> hey everybody, Joseph Rothschild here, AKA MBT. And today we're opening not the Popeye's chicken sandwich, though I am interested, if any of you are listening, Popeye's. Instead, we will be opening not one, not two, but five gold sarcophagus packs. Now, how I came into these, you cannot ask, but I'll give you a hint. They didn't come attached to the actual box, or else there would be piles and piles of uh, garbage in the background. Uh, instead, we will just get right into it, uh, taking to heart some of the lessons I learned in the comments section, which is that you all don't want to see the common cards. That's a little frustrating for me. Come on, think of the ad revenue, and more importantly, think of the copies of Clock Spartoy you're missing out on. All right, first we're doing the pre-con. Uh, I have two copies of Dimension Shifter, two copies of Nibiru, and zero copies of Dark Ruler No More. So by the end of today, I want a play set of each. Let's make it happen. We've got Magician of Black Chaos Max. Ooh, Red Eyes Alternative Black Dragon. And this is the card with the reprint attached. Ooh, yikes. Uh, it gets Red Eyes Black Dragons, cards that don't exist. Obelisk the Tormentor, and I love that art. We also got a Slifer. And it looks like our first Dark Ruler No More. Well, that will come in handy as people recognize that Nibiru isn't effective and out to pendulums. Let's move on to the packs proper. Okay, we're hoping for dangers in here. I don't have the full danger playset. I believe I have one of each. So we need a Jackalope, a Nessie, uh, and a Snack. All right, we've got Gold Fang, Bear Blocker, Hilarious Card, uh, Fluffle. Uh, I'm not even going to try that one. Perform Pal, Hammerai, Samurai, uh, Concentrating Current. Here we go, the Super Cyber Dragon Hurts. All right, with Cyber Dragon Orchest on the horizon, that looks pretty good. And, ooh, a Secret Salaman Great Foxy. Very pretty, but unfortunately, I don't like pulling upscale rarities of cards that I could buy for two cents. For the Ultra, we've got Snake! We did it! Ooh, we're getting ever closer. And then, of course, we've got some Summer Summoner, uh, Rise of the Salman Great, Light Arena, Area Zero, that's important, Fresh Sistart, Monster Reborn, Reborn, Hilarious Name, and a Fur Hire. Okay, so not terrible for a first one. I uh, like seeing the Snake, and uh, Up Rarity Hurts are always welcome. Second pack, let's see what we're opening. Thunder Dragon Discharge, a Red-Haired Hasty Horse, Fandora the Flying Fortress, Damir Vampire Sheridan, really good in Trinity, Goki Tag Partner, Dragoonity Sentis, all right, the Super, Crusadia Arborea, and wow, that looks pretty. Good thing she is very relevant in Crusadia Danger Thunder for the secret. Oh, it's Nightmare Mermaid. Well, I'm happy to have it, but uh, it's just going to get banned in a couple of months. And beat at Ultra. Yikes. This was a stinker of a pack. Realm of Danger, Familiar, Moonsault, Make Make, a Raphael, Salmon Great Falco, and Invincibility Barrier. Oof. A grand total of zero cards I'm happy to see in that one. Uh, maybe I can play the Mermaid as an out to Ebly as Orcus decks start uh, integrating her into their combo. Next we've got... Heartless Drop-Off. Why do they keep printing these? Is there some sort of demand for them? Cybersal Cyclone, Multi-Roll, Vendred Nightmare, Dragus Depelia, Gravekeeper's Headman, Trickstar Bella Madonna. Someone in the Discord was trying to tell me there's like a burn deck that turbos this out, but I don't believe them. Danger Response Team. Oh, come on. Sheesh. I don't want the danger spells and traps no matter how much you try to make me desire them, Konami. And for the Ultra, it's a Thunderbird. I guess that's important if I ever try to build... Oh, uh, I don't know, the uh, Gren Maju deck. Uh, nothing particularly important. Ooh, a Dharma doll in the commons here. And let's move on to the next pack. So we're hoping for Nibiru. Again, I have two of that, but I will take the third Dimension Shifter or the second Dark Ruler no more. Uh, basically, anything is gas at this point. All right. Starting with the Precon. Blue Eyes Alternative Ultimate Dragon. I've got a couple of these by now. Another Palladium Oracle Mana. A... Monster Reborn, and that's the full playset if it ever becomes unlimited. Our god card is Slifer the Sky Dragon, and let's see what we got. It is 
Oh, the third Nibiru! Alright, now I will be unstoppable main decking this bad boy and guru. If you see me this weekend at the Philadelphia Regional, play around at game one. Our first pack. Ah! Dropped it on the floor. Alright, we've got Prompter Thorn. Uh, Dino Wrestler King T. Rexel. God, the Dino Wrestler is treated very poorly. Crusadia Leonis. Mistrick Holder. This sounds like a Tim and Eric sketch name. Uh, Restoration Point Guard. Uh, Transfamiliar. Incantation Candle. Oh boy, oh boy. Uh, I love seeing these cards. The incantations are such a giant boon to ritual, and you know that I would really like to build it at some point in the eventual future. Another multi faker. Come on, I pulled one of these last time. Oh, sheesh. Well, at the very least, it's pretty, but I can't imagine needing more than one. Uh, Nightmare Phoenix at Ultra. That's great. At least I'll be playing this. Celestial Observatory, uh, Vampire Familiar, Goki Moonsault, uh, Make Make, World Legacy Struggle, Clock Spartoy, and Hercules Base. Oof. Another bad one. Come on. What's going on here? Again, we're looking for dangers. I'll take engages as well. I'd, I'd love to build Sky Striker ten minutes before it rotates. Thunder Dragon Discharge, uh, Perform Pal Gold Fang, Sajita, Maverick for Hire, Necrofusion, Solitary Sword of Poison, F.A. Dead Heat, and the Super Cyber Rev System. Blech. Wasn't this card like $45 before the reprint? And let's see. Oh, jeez, a Conditional Monster Reborn. Wasn't this like a common? Yikes. Uh, for the Ultra, we've got a Crusadia Reclusia, but, oh, jeez, a Noble Knight, Castanian, Rise of the Salaman Great, Light Arena, Area Zero, Spiritualist, Cupid Volley, and Gladiator Beast, uh, bad one. Ooh, another stinker of a pack. Uh, that's like four in a row. I don't know who I did to piss off the RNG gods this badly, but, uh, must have been something. Alright, third pack, we've got Trickstar Mandrake, uh, Fandora, Galaxy Cleric, Damir Vi- <laughs> Will of the Salaman Great, Restoration of the Monarchs, and the Super World Legacy World Crown. Okay, I'll take it. I guess maybe it sees play in Crusadia. And? What is this? Morgan, the Noble Knight card? They don't even play this! At Ultra, we've got- Oh, finally! Something playable! Alright, well, I am kind of looking to build Pure Thunder, and Thunder Dragon Colossus is a step in the right direction. Wow, 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 that is pretty. After that, we've got Kadolga, Crusadia Crawler, Boy Cotton, Mayhem for Hire, Dragoonity Taus, Revendra Daybreak, and Predaplast. Nothing to write home about, uh, except for the Colossus, to which I will be writing home. Dear Mom and Dad, today I opened Dark Law, but better. Alright, time for the third pack. The pre-con first. Alright, now we're looking for Dark Ruler No More or Dimensional Shifter number three. We've got Alternative Black Dragon again. Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon again. Regeki! This is the second Regeki I've opened. Boy, I wish they'd stop printing all these limited cards. I open multiples of them and it looks terrible. Uh, Slife of the Sky Dragon again. And... Well, you can never have too many Nibiru's, to be honest. Let's check out the packs proper. All right, let me get a Nessie in this one, please. We've got Crusadia Leonis, uh, Paladin of Storm Dragon. Can't believe they printed this card. It's ridiculous. Uh, ridiculous in that it doesn't need to exist, not that it's good. Uh, Sanctuary, Dead Heat, Mistrick Holder again, Restoration Point Guard. Another Incantation. So that's two Hollows I now possess. Uh, the Necroz, it calls to me. And the secret... Red Reboot? Oh, this is a personal affront to me as someone who likes to play control decks. Oh, well, at the very least, I'll play it. Another Ultra Phoenix. Ooh, we're almost all the way to the playset for our uh, Extravagance decks. Crusadia Revival, Rise of the Salaman Great, Trickstar Light Arena, Sky Striker, Airspace Area Zero, Labellman, Parallel Panzer, and Vampire's Desire. We're going to be able to build entirely uh, Gold Sarcophagus Mega Pack Vampire by the end of this, aren't we? Pack number two. We have Recon, Scout for Hire, Scarlet Scourge, World Legacies Corruption, Vampire Retainer, Link Streamer, Trickstar, the cute one who kind of looks like a tomboy. Uh, don't read into this at all, uh, please. Uh, now the Super. Crusadia Draco is not the worst Super we could find. It's at the very least uh, played in Crusadia Danger Thunder. The secret is... Oh, come on. Ugh, fine. And, uh... And the second Colossus! All right! Now that's something to be excited about. We are almost all the way there on Pure Thunder. I mean, I basically have to build it at this point. 
Uh, Mirror Force Launcher, Goki Moonsault, Make Make, Altergeist, Bad One, Dragoonity Kaus, Vendred Daybreak, and Predaplast. Okay, alright. Our quest for Thunder Dragon continues. I, I wish we'd been uh, finding, like, uh, Dragon Hawks or Dragon Roars. I pulled a one roar off camera, but one roar does not a deck make, especially the one that plays almost exclusively Thunder Dragons. We've got Dealer's Choice, Trickstar Mandrake, Link Turret, Dino Wrestler... Yeah, I'm not going to try that. Trickstar Bouquet, Waking the Dragon, and the Super. World Legacy, World Lance. Disgusting. The Secret? A Sekka's Light. Sheesh, what is with this? And Nightmare Phoenix number three. All right, there's the playset for the Extravagance deck. Blech. Uh, Sacred Noble Knight of Castanian, Link Devotee, uh, FA Winners, Dino Wrestler that I'm not going to attempt, Great Keeper Spiritualist, Cupid Volley, and the Bad Gladiator Beast Link. Well, the Phoenix is something at the very least. Whew. All in all, a couple of really bad packs. Again, looking for dangers here. Let's open pack number four. We'll start with the Precon and, uh, I don't know, um, again, looking for Dark Ruler No More or a copy of Dimensional Shifter. At this point, I think I really want Shifter, even though No More is obviously better. Uh, Exodia, the Legendary Defender, hilarious card. Uh, Mana, again, like an eighth Regeki and an eighth Monster Reborn. All right, at the very least, it's not a Nibiru. Dark Ruler No More means that if this last pack does not contain a shifter, then we don't have the full playset. But more importantly, if it does contain a Dark Ruler no more, we have the playset of that, and we no longer have to fear Pendulum. Alright, pack number one, we have Galaxy Cleric, Thunder Dragon Discharge, Perform Pow Gold Fang, Mistrick Holder, Restoration Point Guard, Transfamiliar, and the Super, it is Great Fly. Why is Great Fly at Super in this? What is Great Fly doing? Alright, for the secret, we've got... Oh, Crusadium Maximus. You know, my roommate and I were looking at the secret list for this and thought, man, if you open Crusadium Maximus, I feel so bad for you. All right, the Ultra. Uh, uh, Trisbania was like an $8 card for almost no reason, so I'm not that beat up about it. Light Arena, Familiar, Moonsault, Shield Handler, like the 8th Clock Spartoy, and a Jamming Waves. That's like the first Sky Striker card we pulled. What gives? Are the ratios on the Sky Striker cards that bad? Alright, next we have Recon, Scout for Hire, Vampire Scarlet Scourge, World Legacies Corruption, Vorticular Drumgon, Contact Gate, Dragoonity Sinutis. Alright, here we go. The Super Cyber Dragon Hurts. Okay, we've got a couple of these now. And the Secret. Woo! That is pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Well, at least we can use one rare Shizuku. She's no money, of course, but. God, look at that. Very pretty. Uh, Thunderbird is our Ultra. Another danger, but not exactly the one we're looking for. Uh, Ballista Squad, Mini Boral, Watch Cat, Daruma Doll, Regulex, and Background Dragon. Yeah, he's going to be the background of this opening. Third pack. We have another Paladin of Storm Dragon. <laughs> With the incantations, we might be able to do this. Oh, real quick. Oh, of course, you can't pre-prep for it. Excellent. Uh, Salaman Great Sanctuary, Salaman Great Gift, Trickstar Bouquet, Waking the Dragon, Vendred Nightmare, another Impcantation Candle! Well, at least it's the good one, but where's my Talismandra? The secret is... Um... I should think more critically about what I demand from the RNG gods. Thank you for the danger, but I wanted a different one. Uh, Widow Anchor for the Ultra, though. Pretty happy about that. Uh, Widow Anchor previously printed, I think, only at Secret, so that's that's good. Uh, Trickstar Bloom, Dino Wrestler, <laughs> Terrifying Toddler of Torment, Clock Wyvern, Salaman Great Falco, Invincibility Barrier, and Consolation Prize. All right, we are into the fifth and final opening. Uh, remember, uh, we need both a playset of Dark Ruler No More and a playset of Dimension Shifter, so anything but a Nibiru is going to be gas here. Let's do the pre-con. Moment of truth. Fingers crossed for anything but Nibiru again. We've got Mana, Blue Eyes Alternative Ultimate Dragon. I think the first Winged Dragon of Raw that I pulled from these packs. A uh, copy of Slifer, uh, so we're just swimming in god cards at this point. And... I can't be that beat up about it. I mean, Nibiru is Nibiru. It's it's a very powerful card. 
I wish I had seen just a little bit less of it. Okay, let's do the packs proper. Dangers, come on, please. Dino Wrestler King T. Rexel, Crusadia Leonis, Paladin of Storm Dragon number 8, Waking the Dragon, Vendred Nightmare, Vorticular Drumgon, God, just a hilarious name, Contact Gate, another Bella Madonna, Bella Madonna Turbo coming along, and... Oh, a second Shizuku! Wow, we're one away, aren't we? Next is... Oh, thank you, God. Oh, okay. So at least we've got the playset of the snake now. Now we need what? The playset of Nessie and the playset of Jackalope. A little harder to find, but still possible. Clock Dragon, Mayhem for Hire, Rise of the Salman Crate, Trickstar Light Arena, FA Overheat, Invincibility Barrier, and Jamming Waves. Let's go to pack number two. There's a huge pile of trash accumulating on either side of the mat. Uh, boy, do I suffer for my art. We've got Goki the Great Ogre, Altergeist Pixel, World Legacy, World Wand, Training for Hire for all your training needs. Oh, stop. Salman Great Mirror, Necro Fusion, su 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 Stage Divers, The Super, Another World Legacy, World Crown, Sheesh, and The Secret. Hey! Danger! Jackalope! All right, we walked away with the entire Jackalope playset. Now all we're missing is one Ultra, of course, it is Nessie, and it's a tall order to find in the remaining pack, because our Ultra is Nightmare Cerberus. Uh, we're almost all the way to three Cerberus for the Extravagance deck as well, like it would play it. Kidolgo, White Stingray, Crusadia Crawler, Dinah, Falco, Universal Adapter, and Vampire's Desire. All right, here we go. Last pack. Nessie, 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 Nessie. Wait, the Endymion stuff is in here? Maybe just this. Uh, Crystal Master. <laughs> the Crystal Beast stuff is in here? Uh, Perform Pal Goldfang, uh, Vorticular Drum God number 8, Bear Hug, Boral Regenerator. This is not the field spell. It looks really similar. Will of the Salman Great, Cyber Switch. Okay, happy to have this. Galaxy Eyes. Soul Flare Dragon. That's our secret. Well, I'm not building Photon, and you can't make me. Next we have Nightmare Griffin, so it looks like our dream of Nessie is dead. After that is Center Frog, Terrifying Toddler of Torment, Ballista Squad, Mini Boral Dragon, Back Rum Grung Grung, Crusadia Power, and World Dino Wrestling. So, that's that. We didn't get everything we wanted, but we got a large majority of it. Very happy about a couple of copies of this bad boy, and hopefully I'll be building Pure Thunder in paper particularly soon. It really just... Depends on what gets hit by the ban list. Uh, as I alluded to in this video, if you're going to be at the Philadelphia Regional this Saturday, I will be there as well, repping Guru and trying to fiend my invite. Uh, feel free to come up to me and say, uh, I'm sorry for your miserable pulse. I will see you next time.